Hi students, in this video we are going to learn exercise number 6.3, question number 2. Third problem, we need to find the x and y value from this diagram. Now, by looking at the diagram, x is the exterior angle. We know that exterior angle always equal to sum of two interior opposite angles. So, opposite angles are 50 and 60. So, 50 degree plus 60 degree we can write it. This comes under what property means exterior angle property. Exterior angle property. So, whatever property you are using, you just write it uh, below to that property. Now, x is equal to 50 plus 60 is 110 degree. So, we got x value. Now, we need to find the y value alone. By looking at the diagram, x and y are lying on the straight line. So, we can say that they are supplementary or they are linear pairs, we can say. So, x plus y is equal to definitely 180 degree because they are linear pairs. Linear pairs means when we are adding, the definitely the answer will be 180 degree because they are forming a straight line. Linear pairs. Now, in the place of x, we can write 110 plus this y which is equal to 180. Plus 110, if you take it other side, it will be a minus 110. So, 180 degree minus 110 degree. 180 minus 110 110 will give you 70 degrees. So, y is equal to 70 degrees is your correct answer. So, we got x value as well as y value. That is all your problem. We will move on to the next problem now. So, fourth problem. Look at this diagram. Here by looking at the diagram, this x and 60 degree are equal because they are vertically opposite angles. So, we can write the x value directly from the diagram. x is equal to 60 degree because of the reason VOA. VOA means vertically opposite angles. Now, after finding x value, we need to find the y value. When we are adding all the three angles of a triangle, it is 180 degree. So, 30 degree plus y plus x will be 180 degree. The reason is angle sum property of a triangle. Angle sum property of a triangle. Angle sum property means when we are adding all the three angles, it will be 180 degree. Now, in the place of x, substitute the 60. So, 30 degree plus y we do not know. But x value we know that is 60. 60 degree which is equal to 180 we can write. Now 30 plus 60 is 90 plus y which is equal to 180 degree we can write. Now plus 90 bring it to other side that will become minus 90. So 180 degree minus 90 degree we can write it. So y is equal to 180 minus 90 is 90. So y value is 90 degree that is your correct answer. Here x value we already got that is 60 degree. That's all students. We will move on to the next problem now. Look at problem number 5 now. Looking at the diagram, y and 90 are equal because they are vertically opposite angles. When the two lines are intersect, the opposite angles formed will be always equal. So directly we can say that y is equal to 90 degree because of the reason vertically opposite angles. Vertically opposite angles are equal. Now, when we are adding all the three angles of a triangle, definitely it is 180 degree. So, we can write it x plus x plus y. These are all the three angles of the triangle which is equal to 180 degree. That is property is angle sum property. Now, x plus x will be 2x. 1x plus 1x is 2x. In the place of y, we can take this 90 degree now which is equal to 180. Now, the plus 90 you take it to other side that will become minus 90. So, 2x is equal to 180 degree minus 90 degree. We can write it. 2x equal to 180 minus 90 is 90. So, x alone we need. So, the multiplication to bring it to other side that will become division. So, 90 by 2 we can write it. So, x is equal to 90 by 2 will give you 45 degree. So, x is equal to 45 degree is your correct answer. So, y value we already got that is 90. So, that is all. We will move on to the next problem now. Last one, question number 6. Look at the diagram. Y and X are vertically opposite angles. So, definitely they are equal. So, we can write it. Y is equal to X. So, here it is X only. Now, this is X means here also it will be definitely X. This is X means here also definitely it is X only. Because this is vertically opposite angle. This is also vertically opposite angles. Now, the interior angle of the triangle is X plus X plus Y. But y also is equal to x only. So, we can write it x plus x plus x which is equal to 180 degree because all the three angles are equal to x only given diagram. 
so 1x 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 will give you 3x is equal to 180 degree now x is equal to multiplication 3 you can take it down as a division so 180 degree by 3 we can write if you are cancelling x is equal to 60 you will be getting 1 times 60 times now x is equal to 60 we know that y and x are equal from the diagram so since x is equal to 60 definitely y is also will be 60 degree only so both are 60 degree so the given triangle is an equilateral triangle that's all students thank you for watching if like our video subscribe our channel for more videos